This video is presented by the Fence and Deck Experts, a proud supporter of the KW Siskins. Check out the Fence and Deck Experts for professional work and quality service. They make your backyard an extension of your living space, installing custom decks with pressure treated or composite wood. They also offer a variety of fence options from wood to vinyl to chain link. Call now to get a quote at 519-804-3325. That's 519-804-DECK. Sunday afternoon, GOJHL action from the Waterloo Rec Complex as the KW Siskins getting set to host the Brantford Bandits in the regular season finale. First period action of this one. And the Siskins would strike first in this hockey game. AJ Ray up top. He makes no mistake to the backhand and buries it. Ray has the Siski buzz up 1-0 early on. Still in the first period, Siskins would keep the offense coming. Zach Janiskowski rips one home, and the Siskins, just like that, go up 2-0 over Brantford in the first frame. Now, a minute to go in the first period. Bandits looking to respond. That's what they do, walking right in. Charlie Pies has his sixth of the season, and the Bandits cut the lead in half. After 20, it's 2-1. To the second period we go. And the Siskins looking to restore their two-goal lead. That's exactly what Zach Janiskowski does as he finds the twine. Janiskowski's got his 12th of the season of the shorthanded variety. And the Siskins go up 3-1. to one. But the Bandits would respond not too long after. As Charlie Pies is going to bang home his second of the afternoon. Just relentless out front as he's able to find the loose buck and tuck it in. And the Bandits have cut the lead back. It's a 3-2 hockey game. But the Siskins' late stages of the second period finding themselves on the man advantage. Will Elliott is going to fire one home up in the slot. Elliott's got his 24th of the season for number 24. And the Siskins go back up. It's a 4-2 hockey game. And the second period getting a little bit interesting. Dying stages of it as Luke Blankhorn and Mason Wright going to drop him at center ice. The two of them each getting a pair of good shots in at this center ice tilt as the Lions been able to step in and separate the two of them. The Siskins would add a marker in the third period and they take the regular season finale over the Bandits by a final score of five to two.